Shalom, it's the brother Azana Moth, back at you with another lesson. All right, first off, I want to give all honor and glory to Yahweh Bahashim, Yahweh Shai, Bahashim, Rekakadosh, and double honors to the elder bishops, apostles of Great Millstone. Now, I came across this video that a brother put together, all right, of this supermodel, all right, who went through all these things, and now look at her now, totally through. And this is what Babylon would do to you. The Lord Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai says, do not conform to the rudiments of this world and the wicked that control it. All right, because they will use you up and spit you out. This is Babylon the Great, that whore. All right. Shalom. All right. Uh, I saw this post and I wanted to jump on here real quick and, and just kind of like talk on it because I remember this girl. You know, she was a video vixen back in the 90s and stuff. You know, she was real popular. And, you know, like, uh, it's it's kind of, it's really, really sad. But at the same time, you know, it's, it's, it's basically the Heavenly Father is using her as an example of what not to be focused on in in this world. Okay. You know, this, this, this industry, this music industry, they push and they, they, they emphasize to our young women, uh, you know, that, they need to become this 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 sex symbol this this um that it's liberating to to basically be a whore right and this is just an example like the lord used her as an example like yo that that life ain't so sweet so what happened is she basically you know like uh, she went into the industry she got really big and she got raped by you know rich and powerful edomites some jakes ishmaelites you know, a bunch of times, according to, 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 according to her. And I believe it 100%, you know, and, you know, it's, it's, it's really sad. It took a complete toll on her. And this image you see on the, on the uh, right here is what she looks like now. I mean, wow, this is like a far cry from, from what she was, but this is spoken of in scripture. I'll get it real quick. Um, is that first Timothy, First Timothy five and six, but she that liveth in pleasure is dead while she liveth. It's not she's not physically dead, right? So her spirit's been completely crushed. You understand? Like, yo, this this she might as well be dead because she's why do you think she's taking the drug? She's wishing that she was actually dead. Okay? She's actually wishing she was dead. And actually what this, this, there's also another scripture that comes quickly to mind is uh, the one where it talks about the, the, the wicked spirit leaves the body and wanders around finding a place and doesn't find one. So it comes back to its old place and it finds it clean and swept, right? And then it brings in several other demons more powerful than it so that the last state of that person is worse than the first. She had a, a lily spirit on her, like a spirit of whoredom on her in the first first instance, right? And that spirit left, right? You know, she was probably like after the first time she got, you know, uh, raped or molested. She, you know, she, she repented and she probably, you know, like she was going into that Christianity thing and the demon left. Then it came back and it was like, yo, I ain't leaving again. And they just brought more powerful ones. And her final state is this, man, like sad do not let these demons out here fool you into thinking that this modeling lifestyle is something to strive for it's nothing more than an incubator right for gullible women to be to be basically abused tortured all of that all these women you see on insta um on social media talking about their influencers and their whatever the glamorous poses and all of that F they're getting flown out to dubai to get shitted on i'm being blunt because that's what's going on all right don't fall for the okie doke keep the faith there's this one girl i used to yo i stepped to her on here on 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 social media right and i was like i'm very because i always ask that i'm like yo do you, you seen somebody and she was like yo i i'm i don't feel comfortable saying that right now and when she said that, I was immediately, I was like, yo, okay. Why wouldn't you want to say that you're seeing somebody if you are seeing somebody? You know what I mean? Like that's, that's proper etiquette. That's the right thing to do. If you've seen somebody, 
you let let it be known so that people don't step to you you understand and yo no lie like that was like a while back and now i'm i'm seeing seeing um seen her page and she's you know she's in this whole modeling thing too and that's one of the re one of the reasons why i made this post because you know i saw this and i was like damn i was thinking on that girl and i was like damn you know like this is not this is not a good look you know what i mean like don't don't go down that path all right this industry is all about the complete degradation and exploitation of women they fool you into thinking it's all about that they're that feminine that they're feminist and they care about women they want women empowerment but to them female empowerment is overt sexuality that's it to them female empowerment is all about them getting you to be a slut because who does that benefit it benefits them you understand all right so with that i'm gonna say shalom to you all man all right keep the faith Thank you.